This one's going to be for uh, the Mate desktop users. Basically, it's all these stuff I talked about in the past already for GNOME 2. But some, they changed some of the names around. So if you never use GNOME 2 and you know you don't care to go back in the past or whatever, then you can always use Mate uh, if you're new to Linux. Anyways, uh, these are some of the settings I used in the past and we'll revisit it here. So first of all, you hit Alt F2 and we're going to type in Mate. Uh, conf dash editor. If I spell that right, there you go. And in here, the first thing I do is enable compositing. So I hit uh, apps here and then go down to Marco. Marco is basically their um, Metacity or their Windows Manager. And you hit in generals here. Uh, let me make this bigger here. But you don't know what a compositing manager is. Let me give you an example here. So you see my terminal, I have some transparency, right? Uh, I can see like, you know, the apps in the background. Now, if I disable this uh, compositing, you see that there's no bling no more. It's just black here, right? And some other apps like uh, some of the docs, they require compositing. And this is how you would uh, enable it, right? So that's that. Uh, another thing I like to do is right here, what is this here? It says actions, middle click title bar. I like it to set it to minimize. I think by default it says lower or something like that, but I think minimize is the best option. I mean, you can do some other ones like maximize or whatever it is on here, but I think minimize is the best here. And the reason for that is that, you know, this minimize button here, I mean, you can do that, but if I middle click with my middle mouse here, it just minimize it, you know, and you, you can't miss it because it's a title bar, you know, and that's what I like to do for that. Anyways, that's all you got to do. Just type in minimize in this option and you'll have it. Uh, other things here. Well, I like the buttons the way it is, but if you're maybe like you're a Mac user or something like that, you can always change it around because um, right now it has the menus here, right? This is the menu. This is the was it, minimize, maximize, and close. So minimize, maximize, and close. And you can always change it. This is pretty old school stuff here. And all you do is change the colon around if you want. Uh, type in menu again. All right, and now you have your buttons over here, and then your menus over here, and so on and so forth. So that's what you can do there if you like the, a different uh, style of buttons. Uh, the next thing I do, uh, go to Kaja here. Kaja is basically their um, file manager, aka Nautilus. And in here, I usually disable all these junk that they have, because by default you'll see like uh, all these icons, which I don't like to see. All right, so you can always just disable it here. Uh, I like it a clean desktop. So that's the settings I have in the gconf, not gconf, the makeconf editor that I usually do. And other stuff, let me see here. I think they have their screensaver somewhere here. Let me search for it here. Yeah, the screensaver stuff, I usually disable this, disable it, put it into an hour or something like that. Power management, uh, the display, I put it for one hour. <clears throat> like if I'm idle for one hour, it just uh, closes, you know, my monitor, it'll just power down. And for my computer, two hours, and it'll just go to sleep, and that's not the way I like it. If you have a hard disk, you want to uh, spin down your hard drive, you can do that here. Since I'm using SSD, I don't really need to do that. So there you go. And that's pretty much it for the settings. And usually, if you want to um, not waste your time doing all the clicking and stuff like that, um, I'll post you all the stuff that I have here for the mate conf here. Right? Uh, basically, all the stuff that we did you know, like the buttons or whatever, I can go, let's say for this this example here, the buttons that we did earlier. Let's copy this sucker. And here, so our buttons right here is, uh, was that, uh, is over here on the left side. And basically we paste this sucker in here. It will just change it back to the way I, I had it before on the right side. And all these other settings like, you know, disable the, um, the icons and stuff like that, it's all here. 
So this is usually what I do. I just copy the whole thing and then paste it into my terminal and I, I have all my settings the, the way I like it. Uh, if you want to do that also, it's not really that hard. You just use the make conf uh, two, uh, and then you set it to the path. And whether it's a, a true or false statements, you use the boolean. If it's a string, um, you know, you type in whatever it is. So the other ones that we used before was uh, was at the middle click here. This one was uh, the string, and you just type in uh, minimize. Uh, if it's an integer, like some of the other ones, that was an integer here. Yeah, like this one was the screensaver. Uh, I set it to uh, one hour, so it's 60 minutes, and it's using integer. And so on and so forth. If you want to use it, you don't have to, but I'll post it up on uh, my GitHub or something like that. Anyways, that's it for this one. Mate, aka GNOME, uh, reboot. <laughs>